stab myself. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ew. Hey guys, it's Nyla and we're back with another YouTube video. So, you guys, we have a couple of things to talk about before the video starts. This video was recorded. You know, I don't even know how long ago. I'm trying to get a good estimate, a good guess, but I genuinely don't remember. All I do know is it's winter and it was summer. So I recorded this a while ago, it wasn't too long ago, it was probably like two months ago, a month ago, three months ago. Anyways, I accidentally deleted my intro to this video while being in a rush. I was finna upload the video, but I was also finna go out of town. So I was in a rush to get it uploaded and being that I was in a rush, I fucked around and deleted my intro. It kind of blew my mood, it kind of blew my shit. So I didn't finish editing, I just took the time to calm down. I don't know why it took me this long to calm down and come back to the video and edit it and fix it. But so I was like, you know, I'm not editing this video. I'm not touching this video. I am mad. Me not touching the video, me not editing the video turned out to be a, a months long thing. So, oh, oh my gosh. Can y'all see my titties? <laughs> did you guys see my cooch on my butt? Say yes if you did. <laughs> don't be looking. Anyways, I'm in my robe. Yes, I'm in my robe. I don't give no fucks. I'm just here doing the intro. This is future Nyla doing just the intro. I'm not here for nothing else. So today I will be doing a gym vlog. I could have been to the gym vlog, y'all, but I've been hesitant on doing it because I'm a punk pussy, okay? I'ma just say it. I don't care. I have really bad social anxiety and anxiety. And I go to the gym all the time like i could have been did this vlog this is really good content this video is more than just a regular gym vlog to me it's me overcoming my fears literally anyways y'all this is my first time doing this video so you know i didn't really record it the best i wanted it to be but we're going to do a part two i said i was going to do a part two to this i feel like this intro is becoming too fucking long i have to do an intro and a fake fucking outro or i think i have an outro no I didn't do an outro. I never do an outro, y'all. I really don't deserve a fucking YouTube channel. Like, anyways, we're gonna get into the video. The next clip is going to be me trying on my workout outfit and where it's from or something. That's gonna be the next clip. That's what y'all gonna see, okay? So let's get into the video. So the outfit that I'm wearing is Spiritual Gangster. Top and bottom. It's called Spiritual Gangster. I have a bit of body dysmorphia. Yeah. I'm gonna catch y'all when we are in the car. A piece of mind, baby. Come and get a piece of mind. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait. The social anxiety is already hitting y'all. I'm in the elevator by myself. And it was a man in here. And it was awkward silence. <laughs> Fun. I'm about to sit the camera up right here. <laughs> oh, y'all look at the view. It looks so nice, Tony. Oh my god. Should I do a tour of my gym? My anxiety and everything, like, it's bad right now. And I'm sweating so bad. Like, calm down. We can do this. We can do this. So, y'all been doing the stair climber. I don't know how long I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do that for probably like 30 minutes. I don't know. Y'all are gonna watch me. Bye. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait. Your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's a feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I f your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your easel and pencils. So here you go, you try to tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight. And I did it for 30 minutes. My edges are turning white. And I'm hot. I'm about to get on the treadmill. It is raining outside. Y'all can't see it for real, but it's raining outside. Keep me rolling, but if we get the up, we got us 
keep a nigga, man, bitch in a fiddle So let me fuck when I want, I just come and go Many dragons I just got the treadmill. I only did that for 40 minutes. Everything's been good so far. I mean, nobody's bothered me. Also, I had to change the angle when I was on the stair climber because the glare over my head. Wow, look at all this sweat, y'all. I had to change the angle when I was on the stair climber because there was a glare over my head. I'm going to catch you guys in the studio. The view is so cunt. Like, like y'all, look how nice it is. Isn't it so cunt? Okay, I'm sorry, I'm gonna lie because I'm not finna be in the dark. I'm scared of the dark. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. My sister and my parents keep telling me I need to work out with weights. Like, I was 114 pounds, but I be doing nothing but cardio because my thing is, like, I don't like exercising and then having to wake up feeling dreadful. Like, I want to be able to wake up and be fine with going to the gym again. Like, and the only way to have that mindset is by doing something. Well, for me, the only to keep that mindset is by doing things that aren't that difficult for me to do so then i'll wake up tomorrow like hey that was so hard i could do it again if i do something that's very hard for me to do i'm not gonna want to do it the next day the next day the next day i'm not gonna be consistent and i'm gonna stop exercising so that's why i haven't lifted weights because lifting weights is hard y'all sooner or later i know i'm gonna have to go upstairs and do the actual machines and shit but i just don't like the idea of having to do the machines and there's so many niggas over there like y'all y'all know dudes love getting buff dudes love working out their muscles it be so many dudes over there and I don't like, I don't feel comfortable going over there with that many men over there with me having social anxiety. Oh, I'm too good for you. I'm way too good for you. You'll take my love for granted. I just don't understand it. Oh. Y'all, what is this stretchy thing doing? Is this what you do? I feel like this is what you do. Right? It feels like it's working on my arms. Fuck this shit. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So now. Thing. Your back isn't that wide. Oh. I'm gonna 
do them like this way. Can I? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Ooh, this is cold. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Energy, bruh. So I need to figure out what I want to do so I can come back better prepared. And I'm gonna try to look for things that aren't as difficult so I don't have to dread doing this because I did not enjoy doing this very much. It wasn't that bad, but I'm not gonna lie. If somebody told me I had to come back and do this again tomorrow, I wouldn't want to fucking do it again. Okay, y'all. I'm finna head in the shower. I'm gonna catch y'all when I get home. Okay y'all, so that's pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be doing a part two and it will be better than this. This was my first time doing this, like I said. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.